I just thought I'd share some funny fucking shit. When I say funny, I mean just something that I thought weird. Apparently, someone is really going to feel ashamed to cheat on a game that literally cheats all of its players for, like, every fucking year. Can you guess which one I fucking mean? Yeah, it's 2K20. (laughs) Nah, but basically, like... Some dude fucking cheated. But I'm sorry, but the only way you can fucking cheat on that game is A, you like somehow get shit tons of VC, get mad packs, or three, you just fucking get a 99 overall like that. And quite honestly, if I had the choice to cheat on a game where I could just get my player bang maxed out like that or grind on Hall of Fame difficulty for fuck knows how long I think it was like a month maybe two months or some shit day after day after day the same fucking bullshit mate I would I'd be Kurt Cobain at this point if I was fucking doing that put it that way I don't know if that's just because I've got like some next fucking mental disorder gang gang ADHD and shit, but yeah, it's just, I just can't see the point, it's like, wouldn't, like, you rather go out and play basketball f- in real life for, like, two fucking months, and, st- and, like, actually get better at your craft in real life, instead of just sitting there on a game where you could be, please don't ask me how this works, but, apparently, in 2K20, you can be seven foot fucking one, or seven foot Plus, and somehow, even if you're a slasher, your your driving dunks and your driving uh oh fuck, your driving dunks go down and your driving layups go down. The taller you get, the worse your layups. Never once have I seen KD struggle with a fucking layup because he's seven feet. Judging by that, Giannis should be fucking bricking every single lap he attempts. The fuck? Judging by that, Chris Ball should be, like, averaging 60,000 fucking points a game. Like, Bruv, what the fuck is this bullshit? But, yeah. Uh, I'm just standing there with the fucking fridge open as well, because I can't be arsed. Oh, I've just fucking lost it recently. Like, if any of you lot have seen the shit that I posted last night, then you, you already know what I'm on about. But, yeah, by all means, if I ever really felt embarrassed or ashamed of cheating on a game that's been cheating me my whole fucking life of having it, uh, I'd have to get something checked up up there. But, yeah, like, I mean, between just normal ass people, I'm pretty fucking sure you'd rather play basketball in real life unless you're in a fucking wheelchair, but then can't exactly say that because there's wheelchair basketball. So even if you're in a wheelchair, even if you're fucking uh, handicapped, enably disabled, you can still fucking play. So any dudes or any girls that are fucking sitting there playing 2K20, just going, oh yeah, I want to be like a a six foot eight Robert De Niro on crystal meth and watch him miss every shot. Yeah, that'd be fucking banter. But when you're actually trying to make a fucking player better than what you are actually in real life, which is, trust me, it's really hard. When you can pull up from logo like Steph Curry and just like bully your way in there and into the paint like you're Giannis and snag rebounds like Will Chamberlain, but you've got the height of a guard, mate, that shit is tough. You know what I mean? So I'm just sitting out here using a fucking center. Well, in reality, I shoot that Steph Curry, like, I rebound like Will, and then <laughs> motherfucker piss off. Texting me and shit. And then... Yeah, I mean... Third, I'm like strong as Giannis. And apparently, according to some people... No names mentioned... 
I have got fucking hella long arms because apparently this dude's like, I don't know, like 6'2", 6'3". <laughs> Bollocks. But yeah, <laughs> he's going, oh, why well, don't you like a couple of inches shorter than me? Yeah, your arms are the same length. So I don't know how true that is. Either way, I think anyone that says that they can beat me one-on-one -on -one is smoking crystal meth. Ain't no one ever beat me in a game one-on-one -on -one in my life. And that's facts. Because, well, do I need to say anything? The only other person I play 1v1s against is a fat fucking dickhead. But yeah, like, banged it in it. Gang gang fucking shit on Pompa Ground. But yeah, I'm releasing the video soon anyway, so fuck it.